Looking to transfer your Skype conversations to Teams? You are in the right place. Let's get started. Welcome back to Silicophilic, your go-to source for tech tips and fixes. With Microsoft ending Skype support on May 5th, 2025, all users must transition to Teams. If you are a Skype user, here is how to make the switch quickly and easily. Method: Move your Skype chats to Microsoft Teams. To keep your conversations intact, you will need to transfer your Skype chats to Microsoft Teams. Here is how. Open your web browser on your PC. Search for Microsoft Teams in the search bar. Click on the first link that appears. You can get it from this link. It's provided in the description below. On the Microsoft Teams page, click the download Microsoft Teams for Windows button. After the file gets downloaded, go to the specific download section to find the setup file. Double click the setup file to run it. Follow the on-screen prompts. When the installation screen appears, you will be prompted to log in. If the account shown in the one you use with Skype, you can continue with it. If you use a different account, click on your profile icon and choose add other account. Then select your account if that appears. Or you can select use another account option. Follow the on-screen prompts. Now you should be able to log in with your Skype account. After logging in, you will be signed into Microsoft Teams. However, you may notice that your Skype conversations aren't showing up here. To migrate them, click on the three dots menu in the Teams interface. From the options, choose Teams Insider Program. Next, click on the Join button and then choose Restart. Next, you should see a prompt that Skype and Teams are coming together. Here, click on the Continue button. Then select your Skype profile. Confirm your name and click on the Continue button. Now your Skype conversation should appear in the app. And that's how you migrate your conversations from Skype to Microsoft Teams. And that's it. Now you know how to move your Skype chats to Microsoft Teams. We hope the method has helped you out. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Feel free to leave a comment below by sharing your thoughts. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.